Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'll be doing a different kind of video. I'll be working on these items that I have gotten from the thrift store and this is what I'll be working on all week. And once they're done, I will share on my channel what I did with them. So I have these two baskets here. I've had them a while already. I, I already painted them gray and I just didn't know what I'm going to do with them. I still don't. I still need to think about it, but I'm accumulating way too many things. So I need to uh, make room for more. <laughs> so, and I have this cute little mirror that I've had for quite a while. It's been in the garage. I've got this wheat and this burlap looks like they made something out of it but I know I can always use burlap and then this cute sign which is really cute on its own but <clears throat> it needs a little something so let's see what I come up with for that and I've got a little birdhouse back there and this cute wall sconce I wish there was two but there was only one and then I've got these two bird cages super cute these candle holders and then I got that bear I think it's a napkin holder I got that for my daughter for her cabin so I think I'm just gonna clean it up and maybe stain it a little darker and then I've got these coat hooks and I think it's supposed to say fair I'm not sure there was four of them and that's what I spelled <laughs> but I'll be changing that up as well so anyway Stay tuned for my video of thrift store flips. Talk. On the bird cages, all I did was add some moss and some garland from the Dollar Tree. And then I added a candle to each one. One of those candles I bought from the Dollar Tree and it didn't have the bottom piece. <laughs> and I never took it back. But anyway, I just added the little one. I just added one candle and then the bigger cage. I added a, a candle stick to rise it up. And so that, you know, is a little higher. And then I just started adding little pieces that I've had left over in my craft room and it was a great way to use up those little pieces that got left behind and it came out so pretty and I didn't do much to it you know I my intention was to paint it but it you know it was a off-white color and it you know that goes great with fall in my opinion <laughs> so anyway that's really all I did to the cages Somebody told me that it's over, I know it's true You made me happy for a while I remember fleeting times when we slept on top of cars Now I don't know you, you don't know me too I remember fleeting times when we watched this park so far
and here they are all done I think it came out so pretty great for fall decor and I can change it up for Christmas you know or I can just leave them plain I, I like to look at bird cages just plain as well so anyway there's that one In which we want in love caught in your eyes Waiting for the sunrise I believe on you Who you were And the baskets, I had already painted these Aged Gray by rust -Oleum. So I just had some burlap leaves from the Dollar Tree. They had, these are so pretty. They've got different colors this year. They had the green, the dark brown, that burgundy color or wine color, and then the regular uh, burlap color, the tan. So these had wires on them and I just pulled them off and I just started layering them into the baskets. And then I used that filler that you see on the right and I poured some of that in and then I just started using the scraps again from my craft room and again I got to use up all of my little pieces that got left behind on other projects I keep a photograph in which we want love caught in your eyes waiting for the sunrise Somebody told me that it's over, I know it's true You made me happy for a while I remember fleeting times when we slept on top of cars Now I don't know you, you don't know me too I remember fleeting times when we watched this park so far Isn't that just so pretty? I love that. It just came out so nice. I, I really did not know what I was going to do with these baskets. I mean, I liked them. I just, you know, I didn't know if I wanted to transform them into wall decor or, you know, what I wanted. Anyway, this was just so simple. And again, I can use these for different holidays. Maybe not the leaf shaped one, but the oblong one I can use for Christmas or you know spring so anyway there's that one and then this mirror I just uh, unscrewed the screws on the sides there and removed the mirror from the stand and then I painted both pieces with the color mineral by Waverly and that is chalk paint and then I took some of the truffle chalk paint and I dry brushed that all over the mirror and the stand. And then uh, from this calendar from the Dollar Tree 
they have some beautiful calendars by the way at the Dollar Tree uh, for next year and they have beautiful photos they have a farmhouse one they have this one they have horses I mean landscapes beautiful beautiful calendars anyway I took a photo or a picture from this and it says simply blessed and I cut it down to size and I glued it down on the mirror side that way I could always reuse this if I wanted to and I just inserting it into the frame here I didn't use too much glue just a little bit on the corners and I glued that in put it back together and wow what a transformation and this was so easy some paint and change the picture you know or the mirror into a picture and it is so cute and right now little stands are really in style right now so you know this one is super super cute I keep a photograph in which we want love caught in your eyes waiting for the sunrise I barely even knew who you were what did you do I didn't care and that bear all I did was stain it with some antique wax and it just transformed it into you know a uh, gave it a refresh <laughs> and that's all I did to that and for the wreath I just removed that raffia bow and then it had these little fork looking wires uh, sticking up I think they might have had beads on it at one time so I just took some of these berries and I poked them through those little wires there and there's three so I just put two down and then one up and then I took some garland from the Dollar Tree and I just weaved that in and out of the leaves and the the wreath itself and that wrapped around two times so that was perfect I keep a photograph in which we want love caught in your eyes waiting for the sunrise I barely even knew who you were what did you do I didn't care cause you were perfect I swear and remember those wires I pulled off the burlap ribbon here I'm just wrapping it around the end of a paintbrush and then pulled it off and made a little springy doodad <laughs> so I added that to the top of the sign there and then I made a pretty little bow and I'm going to glue that on top and this was done And for this little birdhouse, all I did was give it a coat of the aged gray by Rustoleum, added some scraps that I had in my craft room, and you know, sometimes less is more. I really love the way this came out. And for this candlestick, I gave it a coat of white chalk paint, and then I took two of those crepes from the Dollar Tree, and I'm going to stain them with watered down truffle paint from Waverly and then I'm going to glue the two together add some foam and then I'm going to take again those little wires that I took off of the burlap ribbon I'm going to cut them down to size and use them as little staples or stakes to hold down the candlestick to the foam and you'll see that in a sec and then I just started adding some greenery and florals that I've had in my craft room again I just wanted to use up my stash <laughs> so that's I'm giving it a stain right now and this is what I did I keep a photograph in which we want love caught in your Waiting for the sunrise I barely even knew who you were What did you do? I didn't care 
Cause you were perfect, I swear But somebody told me that it's over I know it's true You made me happy for a while I remember fleeting times When we slept on top of cars Now I don't know you You don't know me too I know, I know. It took me forever to get the foam down to size. I don't know what the deal was, but anyway, here we go. <laughs> Somebody told me that it's over I know it's true You made me happy for a while I remember fleeting times When we slept on top of cars Now I don't know you You don't know me too And here I'm, I put a glob of glue down there And I'm going to add some moss to cover up that foam Somebody told me that it's over, I know it's true You made me happy for a while I remember fleeting times when we slept on top of cars Now I don't know you, you don't know me too I remember fleeting times when we watched this park so far And here it is, all done. I think I'm gonna use this for my Thanksgiving centerpiece if we get to do Thanksgiving and get together this year. I only had two candles, but I did go get one for the middle. Anyway, there it is. Thanks for watching. If you like my video today, can you give me a big thumbs up? And I will talk to you soon. Bye.